Hello, I'm Christopher Lund, the school director, and on behalf of all the faculty and staff of Triangle Tech Pittsburgh, I'd like to welcome our graduates and their family and friends to the Spring 2021 Virtual Graduation Ceremony for Triangle Tech Pittsburgh. We're truly excited to be here to honor our most recent graduating class. You did it. Congratulations. This is your day. You're going to remember this day for the rest of your life. Now, while this is a virtual graduation ceremony, don't think for one minute that it makes the celebration any less important. It in no way diminishes the importance of this day. I wanted nothing more than to be able to have you come across that stage, give you your degree, shake your hand. But unfortunately, with the pandemic still going, it's not possible at this time. However, we're gonna do it this way, and it is just as good and just as important as if we were there in person. Now, we're all here to celebrate because this is the conclusion of the beginning for you. This is not the end of the journey, this is only the beginning. And that's the important thing to remember. Where do you go from here and what you do is all up to you. You're only limited by you and how far you wanna go. Find out what you want, grab your dreams and go and get them. Now, it's important to remember and recognize all the people that helped us out along the way and got us here. All your family and friends, those family members and friends that when you didn't want to roll out of bed that morning to come to school, they gave you that little extra nudge to do so. You know, when you felt like the classes were getting a little bit too difficult and you just didn't know if you could do it, the people that gave you that pat on the back and that pep talk and kept you coming to school. They all were on this journey with you. It wasn't just you. So make sure that you recognize those family and friends that were there with you the whole journey. Now, where you go from this point, it's a huge thing. Decide what you want, decide where you wanna go, decide what's important to you. Don't let anything hold you back. You are only limited by you and how far you wanna go with this. You have that degree now. You have all the tools and the skills necessary to go out there and be successful. Don't let anything stop you. So without further ado, let's go ahead and move on with this virtual graduation ceremony. Greetings, Triumph Tech class of 2021. You've all come such a long way to get here today, and that virus didn't help. You've had to play catch up for the last year to stay on track. You've had to switch to online learning in a hands-on field, and you still learn the skills needed to succeed and get to this point. You've pushed on when many others would have just thrown in the towel and quit. I'm honored to be able to speak with uh, you at your graduation. I wish it was in person, but it's yet another sacrifice we have to make together. A little about me, my name is Nick Wells. I served two tours in Iraq in 2003 and 2005 with the Army. In 2007, I was medically discharged from back injury. I was completely lost after that. I worked a long list of jobs from retail, plowing for PennDOT, to working as an EMT, driving truck, you name it, I probably did in that time. And finally, I realized I needed a career, not just another job. I started in Triangle Tech Dubois in June of 2017, exactly 15 years to the day from when I joined the Army. And I started in the welding program. Now, in Dubois, there were 18 of us there. I decided to transfer to Pittsburgh where there was only six. And that was the best choice ever made. The instructors were very hands-on. Thanks to their dedication, I graduated in 2018 with honors, and I passed all my welding certification tests on the first try. Now, I was planning on heading out to the field right away and start burning rods, but the recruiters up in the front office, they had other plans for me. They knew I still had half of my GI Bill left, so they pushed me to get another degree, CADM. And I barely had a week off before I was back in a classroom. Five of us started off with the basics, pens and pencils, with long hours of creating something out of nothing, maybe a few lines, some numbers to design it, but a lot of fun times, including 3D printing everything from miniature frameworks that they used in the carpentry lab to circuit boards that they use in the electronics class and even random items the secretary out front always loves to show off to the visitors. I'm sure you've seen a few of those things out there. Finally, finally in February 2020, I graduated with high honors. And like all of you though, I didn't get to be in person with my graduating class. Not because of a virus, but because I already had a career lined up. I started right away at the Newport News Shipyard designing components for the newest class of nuclear missile submarines. And after a year, I transferred to a new apartment and I work in waterfront engineering now. While I can't say much, too much about what I do for obvious reasons, what I can say is I use both my degrees on a daily basis to find solutions to welding challenges. And I love it. Every day is something different. 
And that's what you're going to run into now. And this is my story so far. It's not over yet, nowhere near. And your story is just beginning. Many of you are young and haven't seen what's outside of the 412 yet. Some of you have already seen the world, but you have an opportunity now to see it and live it on your own terms. You all have a degree now, something that holds a lot of weight in the real world. You're a lot more remarkable than someone that was self-taught, and you'll start day one with the skills and the knowledge to succeed. And many of you are also the first in your family to, to get a degree, and that's something to be very proud of. Your family is proud of you as well. Now you get to represent them and your community by going out and making a difference. Many of you have had to survive with nothing in order to make it here as well. I know ramen noodles don't fill up your stomach very well, but that sacrifice is worth it. Now you're alumni. Now you set your own path, and hopefully without the virus in your way anymore. Now, I'm going to keep it short, simple, to the point. Don't want to keep up too much of your time, let you get back to your family and enjoy what you've managed to succeed. Just remember to always keep learning, to always push on no matter how rough things get, and never settle for good enough. You've earned more than that. And remember, no one trains you like Triangle Tech. Thank you all for being part of this virtual graduation ceremony here at Triangle Tech Pittsburgh. I just want to say to all of the graduates how proud I am of each and every one of you. This graduating class was the first class that came through the pandemic. You guys started in spring of 2020, and about a month after you started, everything went crazy. And I want to thank every one of you for your perseverance and your dedication and all the extra effort you put in. You just would not quit and you kept coming and you kept doing whatever was necessary. That's the kind of drive that's gonna make you successful in life. So I would like to say thank you again to everyone for attending this virtual graduation. I am so proud of our graduating class for spring of 2021. Thank you very much and good night.